Marcus, yes, sir. what's going on, man? Oh, you know, another beautiful day in the Bay Area. <laughs> yeah, buddy. What are we doing this beautiful Friday morning? We are jumping out of a plane at 13,000 feet Hell yeah. for my birthday and for this YouTube page that I'm starting. <laughs> 120 miles an hour? 120 miles an hour. 13,000 feet? 13,000 feet, Yeah, yes. buddy. What, uh, what prompted this? Uh, birthday is tomorrow, and I'm starting a podcast and a YouTube page coming Hell yeah. soon. So this will be my first. <laughs> well, here we are. Happy birthday, man. Thank you, thank you. You ready to party? Oh, yes. You ready to have the best time ever? Oh, yes. Yeah, buddy. Let's, Let's go. Do it. We'll see you out there. Hello, hello. Okay. Welcome into Jack of All Talks. I am Marcus, your, your faithful host and, and leader of this ragtag team of I don't know what. Um, Real quick, I want to give you guys like an idea of why... I decided to do a podcast and what I was thinking when I came up with this idea and how uh, this all came about. So two years ago, I was getting ready to go into my birthday and I was trying to think of something to do on the side that I was kind of a little more creative with or just being able to talk because I had been seeing, you know, you, you peruse Twitter and Instagram and everybody kind of has their side of the story or whatever. And so I kind of wanted to get out and talk and I've always been somebody that's cool talking to other people. So I kind of started having this idea that I was going to do a podcast. Didn't know what I was going to base it on at, at some point in time. At that point in time, I didn't know what I was going to base it on, but this is what I wanted to do. Um, so what I decided was after watching a Will Smith video about jumping out of an airplane where he talks about fear and processing everything like that, I was like, I can jump out of a plane and I'll talk about the experience of jumping out of a plane. And what fears I had to deal with or the things that I reconciled and all that so forth and so on and so forth. So I was like, the idea will be based about fear and pushing through things. And then I jumped out of the plane and the problem that I had was, I shouldn't say the problem. The thing that happened was I wasn't fearful. Like there was a buildup to it. I, you know, it was like two weeks out. I made my arrangements you know, I did all the natural things. I, Looked up power of attorney because, you know, gravity is gravity. You don't know how this is going to play out. But I went through all that whole process. I had two weeks to deal with it. And then when I got there and was waiting to be scared, it didn't happen. So as I was sitting, you know, waiting, filling out the paperwork, saying this, that, and the other, wasn't scared. Got put in a jumpsuit, got put in my rig, walked out to the plane. I'm still not scared. Um... <laughs> we climb up to 13,000 feet. I link in with my, uh, with the person I'm jumping with, with the instructor. I'm still not scared. So the door opens up and we're like, all right, we're going to, we're going to fall out. And we jumped out of a plane and I never got scared. Like there's a very brief moment of fear when you realize your feet isn't touching anything and you're now falling, but it was the, it lasted less than a second. It was, it was just a shock more than anything else. It was that version of fear. Uh, but it wasn't like I was ever truly, truly scared of the moment. Like I couldn't do it or I couldn't go through it. It kind of felt like if anybody's ever. The way I explained it was if you ever had to be in a fight, if you knew you were going to get into a fight. Like there's a stillness that kind of comes with it. Like, oh, at some point in time, this is going to happen. Like this is not a shock to me. This is going to happen. And that's kind of the same sensation when I got from jumping out of the plane. So that really means I had to change my idea of what I wanted to do here. So when it came back up, I was like, I'll, I was like, uh, what am I going to do now for this podcast? Cause I was never afraid. I don't have a fear thing to talk about anymore. So I just came up with the idea that it's all about perspective. Like some people are scared because they're scared of heights. They're scared of planes They're You know, they have trust things or things like that. So I was like, what if I made this about perspective? And that's kind of what I'm trying to get at. I think we have a general lack, a lack of understanding when it comes to each other about perspective. Like nobody sees the other side. Everybody is taking their side and now your opinion is fact. And therefore nobody else can be correct. You can't learn anything that way. Or learn anything else after that because you just decided that your opinion is now a fact and you're going with it and i wanted to kind of create a platform or a situation where people got to talk about things where it could be your opinion and people somebody's gonna have their opinion but there was going to be an amicable kind of discord about it where your opinion could be your opinion but you necessarily it's respected but it also isn't fact like there's no not questioning it so that's why i've started this um i'm trying to get it off and running there's a lot of people i want to get involved 
because I know there are so many people that have different opinions and different experiences, and I think that's what's going to change everything. So that is the game plan. That is the basis. I can't wait to get started or finish. I'm already started at this point. We, we rolling. But to get more and more people on here, they want to talk about things and how they see things differently and just have a general, general conversation and hopefully some enlightenment and put something out that makes people laugh or makes people think. And that is why I'm doing this. And that's what I want to keep doing this for. So hope you guys enjoy. Stay tuned. There will be a lot to come. It's definitely going to get interesting because I know a bunch of characters. So stay tuned.